Hello friends, welcome back to the final part of the ICM Chernobyl number no. 2 diorama, fire engine, whatever. Anyways, if you look back at the review, ICM actually include a diorama base inside the kit and here it is. The problem is, it's, well it's not a problem at all, this looks pretty good, but the bottom portion of it, you get the backdrop obviously of the reactor there and then this is where you would put the the fire engine and the fireman it's just flat so why don't we enhance that so why don't we make our own custom base for that um, that will fit in so we'll have a, a background with a three-dimensional base it's exactly what we're going to do okay I think we're going to make probably the cheapest diorama base ever um, for the base, we're just going to use cardboard, so uh, these were, uh, I think they were only about 100 rubles each, not very much. Thick cardboard, um, this needs to be cut to the correct dimensions, which we've measured, and also we need to butt joint them together, and I'll show you how all that is done. This is air dry clay. This was 170 rubles. I'll tell you how much all this stuff is in dollars up above. This stuff is called Gips. I think it's plaster of Paris basically. So I mix it with water to make some of the accessories for the diorama. White glue. This is black uh, enamel spray paint. I tried to find black acrylic paint absolutely everywhere and I cannot find it. So we're going to use this instead. Some plastic cups and spoons for mixing up the various materials. And another ingredient which we'll go on to which is entirely free.
Thank mm-hmm. you.